Well, right now, ABC News is reporting that New York law enforcement is meeting with the Secret Service and other federal officials to coordinate former President Trump's voluntary surrender next week following his indictment. ABC's Lindsay Watts has you covered on the security preps. This is the first public filing in the unprecedented indictment of the 45th president of the United States, the people of the state of New York against Donald J. Trump. Tonight, though, details of the charges remain under seal until Trump is arraigned. It, it was shocked because this actually is coming to fruition. Trump's attorney, Joe Tacopina, says even though the former president incorrectly predicted his own arrest last week, he and the legal team were caught off guard. He says Trump plans to plead not guilty and will aggressively fight the charges. This is unprecedented in this country's history. Um, I, I, I don't know what to expect other than an arraignment. The investigation by Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg has focused largely on an alleged hush money payment Trump made to porn actress Stormy Daniels to cover up a reported affair with Trump. And whether the true intent of that payment was to avoid negative publicity that might have cost Trump the 2016 election. In a phone call with ABC News, Trump claims the indictment is political persecution and several high-profile Republicans are standing by him. But legal experts point out, we won't know how much legal jeopardy Trump could be in until we see the charges. The assumption is that, yes, there is a felony charge in this indictment because this business records crime can be bumped up to a felony if it is committed in order to further another crime. Tonight, Bragg's office is blasting some Republicans who've been criticizing his investigation and threatening to subpoena him. In a letter, he says their accusations that all this is politically motivated are baseless, and he's accusing them of engaging in unlawful political interference. Lindsay Watts, ABC News, New York.